everyone and welcome back to my channel. So this video is a day at the Toowoomba show. Now I don't really know what's happened but loads of my footage has just gone missing. I don't really know where it's gone. Not like loads of footage from the day luckily. Thank the lord. But I lost like the start of the video. So we are at the Toowoomba show. Now this apparently travels around the whole of Australia but we went to the Toowoomba one which was where we were staying with Josh's family and this is only on for like one weekend a year in Australia and it was the absolute best. So the next clip that you'll see is literally just us arriving. We just got in there um, and just like starting to have a little wander around and then the rest of the day will sort of just flow normally. But I just wanted to start this video and let you know that that's why we just cut straight into it because I have lost a little bit of footage. Very annoying. A bit scared to look through the rest of my footage now to see if I've lost anything else. But that's a problem for another day. I hope you enjoy this one. There is so many Australian videos left to come. But yeah, this is the day at the Toowoomba show. A lot of the entertainment is like the kids from the schools around the area. I read up on it yesterday and there's all sorts on that. It's like by the kids in the area. Yeah, yeah. Everything they do for adults is a duty version of it. Yeah, that's sweet, that's good. Well, I suppose it just sort of... Brings everyone on. It brings them up doing it as well, so the traditional never die out. Yeah. This is the 159th Toowoomba Royal Show. Oh god, look at that, guys. Things on a stick. Oh, they look good, but they look massive. There's a huge lake, which there is some sort of event on. What is the event that's taking place on the lake? A jetpack jet show on the lake. Wow. We are now at the Old Machinery Society. The what? Old Machinery Society. Watching all our old things run. Big races and stuff throughout the day. And look at the little piglets in their little outfits. Oh. They're all in little glittery tops. Yeah. All in little glittery tops, different colours. Oh. Yeah, you should, I'm assuming you can gamble on it and they come around this little trap. My money's on, on dark blue. Dark blue? Yeah. I'm quite liking the like silvery gold oh, one at the front. <gasps> wow, oh wow. I love cockatoos. Look at them all. You know what? I don't know if they are cockatoos. Oh, yeah. They are cockatoos. Are they? Yeah. We're watching some sort of, well, we're prepping for some sort of wood competition. What are they doing? Cutting their feet out. They're cutting a the place to put their foot so they can chop it. We don't really know what's going on. We're just, we're just watching, seeing what's happening. But there's some wood and there's some axes and there's some chopping going on. And it's great to just sit and watch and see what's going on. This is the final of the 275mm 4th Division Underhand Championship. On oh my god, I'm quite nervous actually. <laughs> One, two, three. Rightio, they're all the way ladies and gentlemen. This is our 4th Division cutters getting a taste of the big leagues. What is happening? There's two young fellows up the front here who have just been back from Sydney cutting in the under 21s Queensland team. Ben's that relatively new to our sport. He's uh, used to cut travel with the circuit, cleaning up the rings for us. Look in the front. Oh, Hooper, wow. nice cut by Coop. He's cutting very strong too. today. You've seen Just him number two. Earlier. Come on, two. Wow. Nice one, two. Come on, one. One's slowed down. Yeah, one's. Uh, <gasps> there we go. Oh, looks like he's got second. Nice. Just to check blocks, mate. This is um, very interesting, quite intense. Quite intense, but very interesting. Josh got it right the first time. You went for number two, and it was two. We've gone for four this time. You went for four as well. Number four. I'll let you know what happens. Oh. Four seems to be making some good progress. Wow, this is intense. Yeah, this is close. Oh, look at number one already. He's already turned around. Yeah, so is number three. Number <gasps> two. No, yeah. oh, number one is doing such a good job. Wow. Oh, they're all around. Wow, this is next level. Number eight's looking for a Wow. Yeah, one, one was amazing. Yeah. Two. Massive, massive cows. Are they big? Wow. <laughs> Oh, is that your me? Delicious. What is crazy, you can enter a raffle for a dollar, which is about 50p a ticket, and you can win a budgie in a cage. What on earth is going on? And now we've got all the ones that have won. 
competitions. Best decorated hard boiled egg. He's just frozen, he didn't look real. What has he won? Um, the Large oh. soft feather 2024. Oh, so he's the soft feather champion. Hard feather. Hello. This is not serious chicken I've ever seen. He is a stuck. Look at his feet, he's got big feathers, feet. Big fairy feet. And look at his. Look at the red going on. Best half a dozen. These are crazy competitions. Hey. Look at the predicament this one's got himself into. That cannot be comfortable. Oh, yeah. That cannot it's be comfortable. So you sort of wow. get the gist of what's going on. What it's even tail. is what even is it? And this one's got like purple iridescence if you ever set back up right. Oh, oh. oh I like that. Oh. Oh. oh, maybe not. That Ain't that weird? That is that is messed up that. I can't quite believe what I'm witnessing. That woman, that woman there, just pointed at a pigeon. But I'll show you which one. <laughs> this one. You know the one that looks most like the ones we've got in She pointed at it and she was still here and she went, that is just beautiful. Well, he is the pigeon of the, the shirt. He is the reserve champion. Yeah, first prize pigeon. Pigeon of the shirt. Pigeon of the shirt. And she just pointed at it and went, ah, that is beautiful. She get hundreds of them at Erm A million. The winning prize is here. It is crazy. How we were just having a conversation with the woman that works here, saying you could never ever buy like a raffle ticket to win a uh, little budgie as a prize. And she couldn't believe it, could she? She couldn't believe that we don't just give away <laughs> pigeons. 50p for a ticket. 50p a ticket. It's crazy. Look at this one. It is an experience, that's for sure. I'd quite like him to peck my finger. I'd quite like it if he didn't peck your finger, to be but honest. He's almost out of it. I could just take him out of it. There's no locks or all, is there? You could just, you could just steal the royal champion. <laughs> <laughs> wow, look at this one, it's massive. That is a big one. We've got little budgies and parrots now. Look how beautiful this yeah, one Yeah, that's the fun of that. Look this one's the main Australian parrot. Oh, I've never seen a bird like it. Oh, hi. Can say hello? It's quite cute. Oh, made a beautiful nose. Oh, look at the stripe on his face. Oh, cheeks. Oh, my God. There's so many of them. Oh, God. I could cry. Oh, wow. Yeah, beautiful colour. We are now waiting for the pig race. We got some live music on, really good singing, really good voice. So I put on, well, me and Josh have both said colours. So is this your guy here in front? Yeah, that's yeah? my guy. This is Josh's, and man's the one behind the gold, but that's not like yellow gold. White gold. White gold. I can't believe Silver won. It was in last place for ages. Look at this. You can smell the garlic coming off of it. Oh, they look good. They're hot there. I want to give them a try, but it's way too hot at the minute. I'm going to give this a try. It's so good. It's so salty. <laughs> so, this cinnamon donut stand here. We came to it earlier just to get a drink. And then we was like, oh, we'll come back later for a donut. And that's exactly what we've done. And because we said we'd come back, and we did, the kind people gave us another donut! For free? For no, free. but you said it's because of our accent. Because of the accent! Uh, being English gets you some places, I guess. Is it good? Nice classic cinnamon donut. Excellent. We're having a little walk around the horses. There's like, a, there's like races and stuff going on, so these are all the horses that have been put away until they're ready to race. Nobody's really around here, so I don't know if really people are walking around, but... Oh yeah, do all sorts, it's amazing, it's so clever. Wow. 
Beautiful horses, aren't you gorgeous? Wow! Wow, they're big there. I wouldn't want to get too close to him. Oh, look at his hair! The top. Oh, it's muscly. Wow, look at all the things. This one's one. Look at that. Isn't that just gorgeous? And he's sat down. I can't really see him. Oh, wow. It's very big. Gorgeous. This one's won a lot as well. Oh, look at his hair! <laughs> it's impressive, isn't it? It is. They're just beautiful, beautiful creatures. He's just proper and just really getting off that one. He's up for enough of it. Yeah, he is. He's wearing a right little fit, isn't he? Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh. So, Tilford is a Spencer's monitor or Goanna. So these guys here are the Boring strongest the in the lizard in Australia. These animals wow. here are pure muscle, that's why I hold it. They have been known to knock people out when they hold them up like this and actually break bones. Oh my that's god. That's how strong they are. Yeah. It's quite a common species. Scary. I'm sure most people have seen one of these and someone can tell me uh, what I've got here. Oh. Yeah. Oh, clever girl, aren't you? The red belly black snake. Now, the red bellies do have quite a bad reputation, but they're not as bad as people do think. They come in around the 22nd oh. most venomous snake. A lot of people think they're a lot higher than that. This beautiful snake here is a Colette snake. Oh. Now, the Colette snake is another member of the black snake. Have you heard of that before? It is a highly venomous species of snake, but it's not one that we really worry about too much. They're found right out in the black soil floodplains, deep down in the cracks, where no one really goes. The only people that really get bitten are people that keep them as pets or demonstrators like myself. Hmm. Oh, King Brown. Yeah, King Brown snake. So even Ooh. though it's called the King Brown, it has nothing to do with the brown snake family at all. Oh. This is another member of the black snake family, the Death Adder. Ooh. Oh, I didn't realize And you can see so here, I don't tail this snake like I do all the others. That's because this is the fastest striking snake in the world. They strike out at over 300 kilometers an hour. This snake here is the Eastern Brown. Oh, it's scary. And it's the second most venomous so snake in the world. Yeah, Josh is really Unlike good. He knows exactly batter, what's coming up. These guys are moving into our backyards and even into our houses. <laughs> Great. It's a black-headed python. Oh. So being a python, she has no fangs or venom. She has that beautiful black head there. I didn't paint mm. that this morning. She's evolved that head, so she only has to stick that little head of hers out into the sun, and she can heat her whole body up just from that little bit, instead of laying her whole body out where she's vulnerable to attack. I've got a chicken chip, which I'm assuming is just like a chicken straw. And some barbecue. Mm. I must say the food here is delicious. I've enjoyed everything. I don't know if you can see really on camera, but how big those soles are. Oh my god. Wow. We are currently waiting for the last wood chopping competition of the day. It's the tree sawing championships. The tree sawing championships. Tree sawing world championships. Exciting. So I'm assuming what we've been sat here for, like all day long when we've sat here, we've wondered what these are for. I think we're about to find out. Oh my god. <laughs> what the hell? So you can't tell from this angle how well number one's doing. Oh. And the timing makes him pound for pound one of the strongest cutters there are. Alright, oh, so now you do it on the other side. Ah! Oh. I'm just finding it crazy how that, the boards that they're putting up there is holding them. Yeah, number one's got this, I think. Oh, it's really close between number one and number two. Yeah, one and two are neck and Yeah. <gasps> number one's done it. That was really impressive. 
I'm not crazy. No problem. I wasn't expecting that. We are now waiting for the jet ski and jetpack show. Starts in about 10 minutes, we're just prepping over there. We saw little bits of this earlier when we walked past, so I'm very excited. I think it's going to be good. Oh, 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 look, wow. Oh my God. Come on, please welcome to the stage for Weston! Is he hiding? That's not So cool. Hey, how are you feeling up there? Oh, I feel pretty high up here. I'm a bit high. But like I said, this jet ski is just a water pump with a. And up! And front! You can feel them all, can't you? They're in yet. Coming down, and up, and sitting on. Woo! That tail's going right up. Two, one! Wow. wow. This is apparently the most dangerous trip. And where most jetpackers end up in hospital, apparently. Remember and up, back, and underneath. Oh, yeah. That was impressive. That was really cool. I'm excited about the jet ski. Wow. Is crazy impressive. He's just done five backflips in a row. We're now at the bull ring. The sun is setting beautifully. I don't really know what to expect from this. So they're riding the bulls, I think. I think that's what's happening. So the second guy fell off the bull the second it opened. So not really sure what's happening now. I think they might be letting somebody else out. I don't know what's going on. I'm a bit overwhelmed actually. I didn't know what to expect, but I don't think it was this. Josh has gone down there. He's braver than I am. Absolutely no chance that I'd be going over there. <laughs> oh god. So I've just dragged me to the front row. Not very impressed. A bit nervous. Oh my god. Dude, I will leave. So Josh has just said these are complete beginners. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I feel like I'm going to have a panic attack. Oh, he seems quite tim. Oh, God. Josh just said this is a big one coming out in a second. I don't know why I've come and sat here. It's giving me anxiety, I did not know. Look how many people are here. This is insane. Well, everyone's here. Oh, wow. Hey, this kid's got some talent. Let's see if we can get him home in the numbers here tonight. We're now watching the under 15 and earlier on we saw an 8 year old do it and he got really hurt. He's on the floor. 
keep it under 15. Oh my god. Oh my god. He's a big ball. Oh my god. So this ball coming out now. We've got bulling book of the year. Booking ball. Booking. Is that right? Bulling book. Bulling. Bulling book of the year. No, booking bull of the year. Booking book. That's what I said. Oh, well, anyway, I don't even know what it means, but it sounds scary. Oh, oh, God. Oh, God, God. Oh, my God. Absolutely not. Wow. Oh, my God. Went off the front of him. Unrelated, but how pretty is the sunset? Absolutely beautiful. Gorgeous pink skies. I don't like this part when the when the balls just stand there. It makes me really uneasy it not like knowing its next go, move. Go. Yeah. We are getting some food. We are going to teppanyaki noodles, and I am going for a chicken noodle bowl. And Josh is going for this special. He's still going for the special. Yep, Josh is getting the special. I'm so excited. How good does this look? Oh, oh, it's getting dark. So it's kind of stuck. It's happened that quick. Oh wow! Wow! It's so blurry on my camera. Why is it blurry? There we go. It's a bit better, I think. I didn't expect it to start that quick. Gorgeous fireworks. Oh, let's give me a big one. Oh, this is so good. I was about to say before the fireworks started, I was very not very impressed with my um, noodles. They just sweat very nice, which is so sad. But this has made up for it because this is amazing. Whoa. I love everyone's reactions. I love everyone. Oh, oh, there's some monster truck thing starting soon. I think you can hear it. Hear the revving. Oh, wow. These are some incredible fire. That was amazing. What an incredible oh, fireworks split. It's now time for some monster trucks. Look at this. Wow. How cool. Whoa, look at the front of it. It has straight pipes on it. Wow. Woo. so impressive. The lad that's driving the car is well, 17. 17! Oh. I have next to no makeup left on my face. I have had such an amazing day. Josh, have you enjoyed the day? And it's been great. It's been great. I definitely, definitely <laughs> recommend if anybody's in Australia next year when this is on, if you can get yourself down to Tuckumba Come because it's been such a good day. I'm going to leave the video. Does it travel out? Every city has got a show. Every city has one? There's 10 shows in July. Oh, every city has one. So have a look, see where you are and see if there's a show on. So I definitely recommend. But I'm going to leave the video here. Thank you so much for watching this one. If you did enjoy, please make sure to leave a like and do subscribe down below so you don't miss any other videos. And I will see you very soon. Bye.